What's up everybody? I'm gonna blick it a blow that ass with another condom machine review. And uh if you ain't noticed, I'm a cool guy. And uh I farted before I started the camera, so I'll be farting today. So nah. And uh what up? I'm getting my stuff out of my pockets. I probably should have done that before I turned the camera on, but whatever. Today I got for you Strange Fruit Krusty Charms. <laughs> this is a Lucky Charms based flavor of which I have already reviewed two other flavors which I gave really rave reviews to. And let me tell you something about this brand. This bottle, these bottles, all of them, fucking leak like a motherfucker. And uh, this wasn't something I found out until after I'd done the reviews. But uh, once you pop that seal, Prepare for condensation. I don't know if you can see it and leakiness all over your fucking bottle And that's a pain in the dick. So There's some points lost But anyway, the first two flavors I've reviewed um, If you go back in my log, they were great, but uh This one strange fruit crusty charms and I'm not saying this is a bad flavor. It's lucky charms. It's just not An important flavor uh, I get little bitty cereal notes. Light ass cereal notes. Really light. Like, if you've ever vaped like a, uh, like a milk and honey or something like that, the, the, the attempt at Cheerios, the, the OT flavor, you get a tad of that in this. And then you get marshmallow. A little bit of marshmallow and uh, is it satisfying well, at times I gotta crank this bitch way up 55 which is way up for me I usually do 45 50 but right now it's gonna be one of the times where it's not so satisfying for me Every now and then I'll vape this and I'm just like, eh, I can't fucking taste anything. Why am I vaping this? Why can't I vape something different? And then every now and then I pick it up and I, I haven't ate nothing or I haven't drank anything. And it's just like, damn, you know, this is light and weird, but it's good. And so I'm kind of on the fence on this one, but I wouldn't buy it again because 90% of the time there's nothing there. Every now and then you're going to pick it up and be like, ooh, yeah. I really like this Lucky Charms bullshit, but most of the time, no. So, you know, if you're a dripper, maybe get yourself a bottle and drip it every now and then, but your prominent flavor is going to be marshmallow. So, if you wouldn't drip marshmallow, don't buy this. Okay. You do get cereal, you do get marshmallow, um, but maybe Lucky Charms ain't the best flavor for a vape. Maybe that's why it's not going all haywire like Fruit Loops did. That's the issue. That's the issue. Um, the flavor is, it does match the description. It does taste like Lucky Charms. The Lucky Charms tastes like a plain ass oat cereal that's lightly frosted and marshmallow. It doesn't really translate to a good vape. You just get kind of a, a sweet blank slate vape. And that's my opinion on the strange fruit. Uh, Crusty charms. It's not that great. Wouldn't buy it again. <coughs> but I am a fan of the wine. I, I did thoroughly enjoy the last two juices I baked. Booger, sugar, whatever else it was. It was there, but it's good. so much i gotta go i will see you later i get two days off it's gonna be badass probably get a drunk review whatever i'm gonna vape one more time one more two off this motherfucker
gross. It's not bad. I gotta go.